The Young Professionals for Justice and Integration has issued a 48-hour ultimatum to the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission to explain with diligence the issues surrounding the controversial 20 billion naira involving the Kogi State Government. Correspondent Habib Lawal reports. When reports of Governor Yaya Bello contesting for the top seat in the country began to dominate public discussions, many accused him of not doing enough for his state, while others cheered him due to his age. But with announcement of the presidential bid came reports that the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission had received intelligence reports of a financial nature. The intelligence given claimed that the bailout funds given to the states by the federal government was domiciled in a fixed deposit in a new generation bank. The funds had been meant for the payment of salaries. The Kogi state government responded, insisting that the funds claimed to have been found and returned to the Central Bank of Nigeria did not belong to the state. It's claimed to have already disbursed its bailout loans for the purpose of which it was granted as of October 2019. The conveners of this briefing are insisting that the EFCC come out with a true position of who owns the 20 billion naira, backed with verifiable evidence. This is why we have taken time and spent resources to research this allegation and hereby request the EFCC if it is acting in the national interest to consider the following and address Nigerians within its finding within 48 hours. FCC does not need to belabor itself embarking on a media trial at all, but it should publish the account opening process and the account mandate of the Koji state government. It is common knowledge that for such an account to be open, an approval is obtained from one, the Federal Ministry of Finance, two, the Debt Management Office, three, the resolution of the Koji State Executive Council, four, the resolution of the Koji State House of Assembly. The EFCC has gone ahead to publish on its official website that the Central Bank of Nigeria has acknowledged the receipt of the sum of 19 billion 333 million 333,333 naira, 36 kobo, recovered from the Kogi State Salary Bailout account. Abida Lawal, TVC News, Abuja.